All right, welcome back, trainers. You're with Pewter City Gym, and we're going to go ahead and carry on with our playthrough of Pokemon Scarlet today. How y'all doing? Hope you had a fantastic couple days. Uh, so, we are... Oh, by the way, Merry Christmas. If you celebrate, I know that that was yesterday, uh, but I don't generally upload on a Sunday. So, uh, today would be Boxing Day, for those of you who know what that is. Um, the gym test, yay! So... Yes, I hope that you had a, a fantastic uh, Christmas if you celebrate, and if not, I hope it was just a nice Sunday. Sundays can be really, really good. Okay, so we just... Oh, I don't know why I crouched there. It's going to take me a minute to get used to the buttons again because I uh, I haven't played for a couple days. All right, so we got Cacciatore. We got Parfait. Uh, lagging behind a little bit, uh, everybody, in terms of stats, unfortunately. Pumpkin Spice. We got Custard, Sourdough, and Cupcake. Um, and, uh, the last thing that we did was we got our third gym badge. No, fourth gym badge. Um, and I really want to just tackle the Path of Titans again. Alright. Gonna take on the next Titan, because I really want to help Arvin. After finding out that it's all, you know, to help his sick dog. I mean, how could I not want to help Arvin? Oh my goodness, those things are creepy. Ghastly! What is that? Oh, it's Meowth. I'm like, what is that thing? And it's the most basic Pokemon. Oh! ra ta ta, -ta. Yo, Jim. So somewhere in the middle... Oh, somewhere in the mines that are around here, we should find the Lurking Steel Titan. Rumor has it that the thing is staggeringly huge and real long. You'd think a Pokemon like that would be easy to spot. I wonder how it stays hidden. Maybe it's super fast. If that's the case, riding that Pokemon of yours might help you catch up. Well, I mean, I already am, so... Great job, Arvin. I've been playing this game for several episodes. What are you? <gasps> it's a little engine. Varum. Aha. Aha. This is what I have been told about. Okay. Let's see. All right. Parfait, I'm going to have you catch your replacement. <laughs> It's going to be a bummer not to have a water type, but uh, that thing... So I'm pretty sure that this is the thing that uh, turns into the uh, the Pokemon behind the... The Starmobile. Okay, one more shouldn't kill him. Oh, poisoned. Okay. Let's see, what Pokeball do I have that I can catch it in? Oh, Luxury Ball. It's gotta be. I got one more, so if we don't catch it, we'll... Ah, yeah, okay, so we'll bring out Custard, we'll paralyze it. Oh, Parfait fainted anyway. Okay. Oh, I don't have paralysis on this. I thought I did. Never mind. Well, hopefully this catches it. Nice! Okay. Varum. Okay, Sardo wants to move to learn. Uh, oh, no, we're not going to worry about Roar. Okay. 
It is said that this Pokemon was born when an unknown poison Pokemon entered an inspirited an engine left at a scrap processing factory. Oh, yeah. Um, we are going to name it. So I have a food theme going on. This thing doesn't really lend itself well to food. Um, so we're going to call it Air Fryer. Air Fryer. Welcome to the team. Add to your party. Sorry, Parfait. Okay, so it evolves once. Alright, let's, uh... Well, whoops. Okay, we're healed up. Let's go ahead and move it to the head of the party so it can get those extra XPs. And we're going to be heading over that direction, it looks like. Oh, gosh. Just trampled on these poor roly-coly in this car coal. Uh, probably not going to want... Not going to want to fight a fire type with my new steel and poison type. Go, Cupcake. Mud shot. All right, one more mud shot. We should be good. Way to go. All right. We did it. Let's see, maybe through these tunnels. Oop. What is that thing? Oh, it's just a young goose. Oh, it's a, a gum shoes. At level 24, well, we may be able to do this. Look at this goofy little engine. Perfect. Gosh, it makes me think of a, uh, like an old cartoon. Like, like something from the Bouncin' Squish era of cartoons, like Cuphead, almost. Oh, no, no, no. Ah, darn it. Cacciatore. But we do need to use... Oh man, do I have any revives? I don't. That's right. I really need to go to a Pokemon Center to buy some healing items. Darn. Okay. In fact, let's do that before I try and face a, uh, a titan of unknown strength. Aha! There you are. All right. Well, oh, gosh, okay. Okay, let's go. It's a steel type, so probably going to want to bring up pumpkin spice. Oh, gosh, I love that design. It's so goofy. 
It's a robot worm with arms. It's like a robot caterpillar. Uh, let's see. We're going to go ahead and bring a pumpkin spice. I feel like that's the better play. Ooh, actually did a fair bit of uh, damage. Uh, let's see. We'll go for incinerate. Don't flinch, don't flinch, don't flinch. Oh! Flamethrower, then. Oof. Oh! Oh, oh my gosh! Okay. That did a lot more than I was expecting. Wow. Let's just uh, go ahead and move Pumpkin Spice to the head of the team. And heal. And let's go. Ooh, we're gonna have to fight it underground, maybe. Nope. You can't escape from me! Oh, you escaped from me. Wait a second, there it is. Okay, Arvin. Oof, that's quite a headbutt. Okay, Earthworm. I get it, like, Earthworm and Ore. Managed to pin down the Titan? Yes, we did. That's the Lurking Steel Titan? It's, uh, well, it sure is long. I think our little friend might be even feistier now after eating those herbs. We're gonna need to do this together, Jim. Sounds good, buddy. Let's go. Whoa! Though, considering how much damage I did last time, I may not even need Armin, uh, Arvin's help. What has he got? Doesn't matter how big the opponent is, victory is going to taste as good as my seasoned by my toadstool? What is that thing? Ha! Later, guy. Gee whiz, maybe I should have done this before uh, the gym. Yay, we did it! Nice. Couple level ups there. We did it, Jim. Way to go, little buddy. Did you get a good look at its face, though? I didn't expect it to hide to be such a little cutie. I bet if we go in here, we'll find more of that Herba Mystica at ate before. Let's go find it before that thing can regroup. I'm sure there's some in here, too. Oh, it's a Pokeball. Aha! What is that Pokeball for? I knew it. I spy Herba Mystica. Okay. Oh, it's the salty one. Another successful search. We're on a roll. Now then, let's see. What does the book have to say? Well, apparently salty Herba Mystica helps with aching hands and feet. Good for neuropathy and numbness. When you've got muscle weakness, it supposedly builds up strength again. That'll definitely help Mabo Stiff feel even better. Come on, Jim, let's get some food going. Yeah, here it is. Sorry to keep you waiting. Here you go, another of your favorite old Arvin sandwiches. And it comes with a special Titan badge. The Pokemon League might not recognize it, but I hope you appreciate it all the same. 
Okay, it's our third one. Lurking Steel Titan defeated. Path of Legends. I don't see that Pokeball anymore. Gas. Figured this might happen. Don't worry, I made extra this time for that brood of yours. <laughs> sniff, sniff. Do you want to give your sandwich? Yeah! Let's go. Come on out, Mad Stiff. I've got some for you too, bud. Yeah, there's that Pokeball. What is, what is the deal with that? I love the hair texture on Mabba stuff. It looks so cool. That's it. Small bites. Small bites. Chomp, 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 snarf, snarl. He eats like me. I don't do that, though. Crydon will be able to jump higher now. Oh, very cool. Come on, at least bother to taste it before you swallow it right down, would you? Yeah. This brute seems to be benefiting from the herbs, too, I guess, in its own sort of way. Oh yeah, before I forget, Jim, take another look at this. There's always a Titan Pokemon near the Herba Mystica when we find them, right? Like the book says, it's not like big old Pokemon just happen to like these herbs. It's actually something in the herbs that's making the Titan so big and strong. So does that mean a Titan's lair isn't really some kind of treasure hoard or whatever? It's just a pantry where the Titan keeps its food? I mean, honestly, that to me is a treasure trove. <laughs> oh, you done with your sandwich, Mabastiff? No. Oh. oh. Rough? You you heard that right, Jim? Mabastiff just woofed, right? Yes, he did. Who's a good boy? Right, I'm not imagining things. Rough. See? See that? I knew I wasn't just hearing things. Oh, Mabastiff, who's my best bud, huh? Who's the best of boys? You are. Yes, you are. Oh my gosh, this guy. Stiff. It's been so long since I heard that woof. Oh, Mabistuff is definitely getting better. Ever since I teamed up with you, good things keep happening. But we've still got two more herbs to go. Hope you'll stick it out until we're done. Yeah, we will. Woof. Oh, I love it. I love it so much. I just want to take on all the rest of the Titans. ta 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 Hello, Jim. This is Sada. I detect that Karaidon has regained more of its original power. While you are riding upon it, it seems it can now jump higher if you press and hold the B button. Okay. Please continue to take good care of Karaidon. We will take good care of Karaidon in the next episode. Hey, I want to thank you so much for joining me today, guys. I really do appreciate it. I'm looking forward to catching you in the next one. But until then, please take care of yourselves. And uh, I will see you next time. Bye.